I want you to help me. Help me on my journey. Help me on my way. Yeah. Oh, Lord, I want you to help me. I've never been so disgraced in my whole life. What insolence? What rubbish? Harry! Harry! Where is this stupid boy? Harry! Come out of this, come out of that place. Yes, Dad. Is this what your mates are doing? Is this your graduation certificate? Impregnating useless girls all over the street. If you don't respect yourself, what about you ask your noble, your noble parents? You know how famous we are in the church, and yet what will make us a laughing stock? The shame is just too much. Of all people, that useless dickness, Felicia, whose mouth runs like a river, experiencing turbulence. She might have told the whole church by now. What do you have to say for your stupid self? Henry, are you prepared to be a father? You that cannot even take care of your room. How much more a human being? Henry, what have you to say for your stupid self? Answer me! If I handle you the way my heart is compelling me right now, you will find yourself in an emergency room. But I didn't do anything wrong. Who you shut your guy your dirty mouth? Is it because we were covering up for you at the Kinesis for this last place? Henry, what did you just say? You didn't do anything wrong. You are right, my son. You didn't do anything wrong. Maybe if you have impregnated the Kines Felicia, you would have done something wrong instead. Are you ready to be a father? As for me, I'm not ready to be a grandma. Not for that useless the Kines Felicia and her household. Hmm. You can imagine her calling us a refer. Imagine her. Hey, go get me your phone. And for the next couple of months, no allowance for you in this house. You need to start fending for yourself. That's what real men do. Give it to me right now. Give it to me. Hmm. Jesus. I mean, my dear, what can you make of all this? Can't you see the hand of God in this? Is it that God is punishing me for standing up against the pastor in the church? Don't go there at all. Why should God punish us? <laughs> is it okay for pastor and his wife to run the church the way they like? If anyone is being punished, his dickness Felicia, mm. her untamed waywardness, mm -hmm. has rubbed off on her daughter. Mm. Don't let the devil make you feel bad. But why us? Why our son, Henry? Why not someone else? Why are you asking all this question? Mm. It is because you are a big fish in a small river. Mm. The church is a small river. You are the big fish. Mm. You should start thinking of starting your own parish. Mm. After all, you have all it takes. You are well loaded. Mm. You are highly anointed. People love you. What else? Please do not let the devil discourage you at all. Relax. Do you want something to eat? I'm about eat? At 1.30 in the afternoon? Are we not fasting? Fasting for what? For what again? We've had enough stress for one day. Do you want something to eat or not? Um, okay. <laughs> I mean, if all these are happening while we are fasting, I wonder what will happen if we don't fast. Maybe. Add more to that food. Let's okay, let's okay, eat. Okay, okay. Thank you, my dear. Good morning, sister. Good morning, Aluchi. How was your night? Alright, thank God. Hope you slept well too. Not really, my dear. I was on the phone all through the night talking to some church members about the Kines Felicia issue. Before the Kines Felicia captured them with her lies, she doesn't know me at all. I am beating her to her own game. What are you shaking your head for? Sister, sister, when did you become like this? Uh -uh. What do you mean? Like what? How? How? I overheard your conversation with your husband and Henry yesterday. I was surprised at your trances. I'm still trying to understand you here, Oluchi. Are you not Christians? In my own opinion, you gave an ungodly counsel to your husband. You even made him break his fast early. Remember what Proverbs 14 once says about a wise woman? No, I don't remember what it says. Since you are well versed in the Bible, why didn't you educate me? Didn't the same Bible say you should not be a busybody in other people's matter? What 
What do you know about husbands, Oluchi? <laughs> Are you married? <laughs> Sister, I don't have to be married to apply the scriptures or quote them. What happened to you? You used to be the strongest of us in the things of God. What happened now? Oluchi, please leave me alone with this early morning sermon. It's because you don't live here. The Christians in my church are terrible people. Hypocrites and mustards. From the pastor down to the children's church, no one is good. How can you explain a teenage witch getting pregnant for Henry? You should have been there when the girl's mother was insulting herself. And you are here talking on their behalf. Uh -uh. Please, sister, enough of the name calling though. These are God's people regardless of your opinion of them. If they are all that bad, why don't you show them a good example? By setting the right way, instead of adding to their destruction. Look here, Oluchi. Was I not the one that led you to Christ? Do you know more than me? <laughs> Do you know more than me, Oluchi? That you are quoting scriptures from me. Don't annoy me this morning, please, Oluchi. Sister, thank you for leading me to Christ, but you were not the one that saved my soul. Jesus did. All I'm saying is that God is not in the midst of confusion and strife. Remember the Bible says, follow peace with all men and holiness, without which no man shall see the Lord. Let's start a fresh this morning. Oluchi, good morning. You are only here on holiday. Don't spoil it for yourself. And is that you? And? And is that you? Hey, how are you? Good, yourself? Well. Wow. Well, I'm doing great now that I've seen you. I mean, I really, really miss you, Anne. My life is incomplete without you. I did. Stop with all this pretense and your games. By the way, I heard about you and Lizzie. You guys make a lovely pair. Are you laughing at me? No. I mean, are you done with your nursing exams now or what? Seriously? That was four months ago. Four months ago? And why didn't you tell me? What difference would that have made? Well, I would have gotten rid of Lizzie like last year. I did seriously. I have to go. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait, wait. You know what? We'll do lunch on Sunday. You know what? Better yet, you come over to my place and I'll make you lunch. I did stop with all these games. Are you really gonna make me chase after you? Seriously? Okay, fine. We'll do lunch at Latushi's then. No. See you in church Sunday. What? Yeah, but you do know what the book says. Faith coughing says be not as all they are. Ah, uh, did <laughs> you are losing it? <laughs> what do you mean I'm losing it? Did you say that you prefer her over Lizzie in the first place? I mean, I don't understand you. What's going on? I did. She has not agreed to come back to you. Yet she's an advocate. Again, when she comes back, she will be your brain. So what did you guys talk about? I mean, we talked and everything, and you know what? She's starting to look more beautiful now that she's a nurse. <laughs> I mean, you gotta see her. She's really spending her money really well on herself. Why are you smiling? <laughs> what did you guys talk about? Tell me. Well, that's why I came here for your advice. 
I mean, I'm really trying to settle down with this babe, but for some reason she's playing hard to get. I mean, I don't understand it. I beg, please, when you make up your mind about this issue, you can come back to me for advice. Last week, you were still with Lizzie. What did you guys go talk about? <sighs> How many times will I tell you that Lizzie is not wife material? But she is very much available, though. I will available? <laughs> I don't get you. <laughs> Oh, Philip, must I spell everything out for you? I can get Lizzie to do whatever, whenever, and however. I mean, don't you understand? She's a good actress, though. I mean, I really gotta give it to her. What kind of life are you really living? You need to be born again and again. I've told you. When you make up your mind on this issue, you can come back to me. Okay, please, please, stop. Enough of all your sermons. Thank you very much. Enough. Why did you come to me in the first place? For prayers and advice. I won't talk to you about this issue ever again. Oh, Lord, I want you to help me. My sister, mm -hmm. my foolish sister, mm -hmm. that doesn't go to church as much as I do, mm -hmm. doesn't pray half as much as I do. <laughs> He's now engaged. Eh? I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> hey, my life. Wait, are you serious? <laughs> hey! She's lucky, oh! Girl, Hi! Chai! Mm -hmm. Well, no offense, mm -hmm. it depends on who oh. she's engaged to. You know, there are guys and there are guys. <laughs> you know. Hey, if they don't go there at all, mm -hmm. my sister hates it. Big time. Mm -hmm. You know the pastor of this church, this First church. Gospel's Mission, and he's never married and a motivational speaker. Wait. What? You mean Pastor Bob Briggs? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. How did your sister manage to eat that kind of big fish? Oh, yep, yep, ah, listen yep. to your life. Mm -hmm. My friend, what is my offense to God? Mm -hmm. eh? What have mm -hmm. I done that life. he bypassed me, mm -hmm. a whole me, mm -hmm. and let Susan? That's that that's that thing mm. to get engaged to Pastor Bob, like the big the biggest and hottest guy in town. Like, you know when they say the race is really not to the swift, yes, mm. not the battle to the strong. Mm. Well, mm. how will you explain my sister, mm. my sister mm. getting Pastor Bob rather than sharp babe like me? I know. Eh? Ah. Hey God, you ha you have to help me. You know what? I have just the perfect solution for you. What oh, if you're the solution provider? Mm. I don't trust you. Trust coming from you, mm -hmm. Rachel. Mm -hmm. Anyway, Lizzie, do you like Pastor Bob? Uh uh. How do you mean? Mm -hmm. uh -uh. He's already engaged to my sister. <laughs> hey. yeah. mm. I beg, which is your engagement? Is it not you, Lizzie? If you want something, you get it. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey, I want to get married, but eh, not my sister's fiance. Abba, mm -mm. Hey. no way. Hey. Eh? Cook your sister off now. Ah, if Lizzie does not want the plan, me I want now. Hook me up now. Ah, ah, hook your sister off. Who's your sister? Mm. Sorry, please, I don't do witchcraft with her. Efe, please. Efe, who's a witch? That's why you call me to trust me, Mr. Go. Efe, you better be careful. Yeah. Oh, oh, now you want to talk. Yeah, hey, let's talk now. What were you doing with Anne two weeks ago, Sunday to be precise? Eh, hey, hey, wait, wait. Sorry, but which Anne? Talk now, you don't speak in this way. Effie, you are such a devil. Me? Rachel, you give people a bad name. Ha ha! So now you want Pastor Bob Briggs, right? But it's not your time. <laughs> you got chance. You don't want to be a lady's son, it's third wife. Uh -huh. You know you're going in life. Hey, hey, I beg. Which one is a lady's son again? Effie, mm -hmm. one day, this your mouth will kill you. Stop me. Mm -hmm. Listen, my dear. I'm out of here. Run away from here, foolish girl! Lizzie, <laughs> now I keep telling you, this foolish girl is not your friend. She's not your friend. Efe, you know, I really think you hurt Rachel with your chances. That wasn't fair. That was intentional anyway, so what are feelings? That girl is not your friend. I don't know why you're still angry with her. Hmm. You know, she's very, very peculiar. So? 
you know, you have to deal with her with wisdom. And yes. Aoku is a very strong herbalist. Be careful. Don't say I didn't want you, Efe. I warned you. Please, they will both perish in their ways if they try me. Herbalist, they call. Philanthropist. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. I was really shocked when I heard this thing from Sister Jo. This is not good for your image. Jo. My question is, where were you people when your children were running around and making a mess? Mommy, she just gave you her own version. That was her own version that she came and poured out to you. That woman is one troubling the whole church. She and her entire household. Now that both of you are grandmothers in the making, what do you intend to do? Hey, mommy, please. This is not a laughing matter. I just, it's as if you're laughing at me now. I will deal with our criminal family. You don't know yet. Please stop calling your in-laws criminal. Hey, where is Fatima? Children of nowadays, eh? When I was 15 years, the only thing I know is my book and my chores, house chores. So what do you intend to do? Honestly, I don't. You know what? I will take this matter to our pastor. Did I hear you right? Which pastor? Our pastor now. What do you think the pastor will say? He will laugh at you. Hmm. Especially that is pretentious wife. You need to. So you have not wisened up. You have not learned anything from what I'm teaching you, Felicity. offense now, but I don't think this is the right mindset. We have a big problem in the church with another family in the same assembly. And you're saying I should not take it to, to our pastor. Yes, I said so. But he's our pastor I now. said so, Felicia. I said so. Was it not recently that we had a meeting and we confronted him? A.P. John, who is a ring leader, is the one that you're accusing his son for this shameful act. What do you think the pastor will say? I ask you again. He will say that God is punishing you for confronting him. Mm. God. Mm. God. How did I how did I get into all this mess? How did I get involved in all of this mess? And I'm not a troublemaker. Oh. Everybody knows me in this church. I know I'm not a troublemaker. How did I get here? How? How? Hey, I used to be a feminine Christian until I became friends with that useless, rotten Mrs. John. And she put, turned my Christian life upside down. Hey! Now I know. How are the mighty fallen? How are the mighty fallen? Which mighty are fallen? You know what? <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry I called you right after church, but. No, 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 no. I have to go. Which I have to go. I will hey. tell you later. You are my life. You are my life. You are my life. You are my life. You are my Had a good morning. Uh, bro, good morning. Was it Lizzie's voice I overheard in this house last night? What do you mean? I had voices last night when I was studying. I had your voice and that of a lady. Please don't tell me it's Lizzie. So what if it was? We both have equal rights in this house. I mean, I can bring in whoever I choose to bring in. I think you're starting to wear the cap on my father. Let me tell you, it's too big for you. Ade, you insult me. What kind of lifestyle is this? What kind of Christian are you? Where is Christ in you? The Bible says that you should not be deceived. 
and that Christ is not mocked. For whatsoever a man sows, that he shall also reap. What you are sowing will reap you a great harvest. Bro, you know what the problem with these is you don't know how to relax, have fun. You're too boring. Huh. But thanks for looking out for me though anyway. I appreciate it. Ade, can you do me a favor? My friend, what do you want? Can you please stop teaching in the Sunday school class? <laughs> Excuse me? It will ease my body. And at least I'll be rest assured that you don't know the scriptures. You are living a false life. And God sees you. The Bible says, Let him that is filthy be filthy still. As for Lizzie, a saint will definitely find her out. <laughs> Amen. Thanks for all your prayers, Dad. Fatima, you're such a drama queen. How could you peg this pregnancy on me? Seriously, Henry? Please stop acting. End of script. This pregnancy is yours and you know it. Period. I really hate you right now. My parents are making life a living hell for me all because of you. I was not the only one you were with, so why don't you go to the others? Oh, wait, I get it. You have memory loss because there were that many, right? Leave me alone and get away from me. No, you leave me alone. You get away from me. I have my whole life ahead of me. By the way, Michael told me that you slept with two of his friends at Javon's party. You disgust me. Tell me, how am I the father? Huh? How do you know it's me? Why me? What are you saying? Michael said what? Please, this is just too much for me. Please save those tears for the other guys. You're going to need it when you go to the other guys, Miss Generous. <laughs> Fatima, where have you been? I've been looking all over the school for you. What's the matter? Are you crying? I told you it was a bad idea confronting Henry about the pregnancy. Oh, have you spoken to him? What did he say? He cursed me out, calling me all sorts of names and saying all kinds of bad things about me. Uh -huh. So where is he now? Am I supposed to answer that? How am I supposed to know where that crazy guy is? Okay. Look, Fatima, stop stressing yourself. Let both of the parents solve the problem. His parents are aware of the situation too. They are supporting him. They met the pregnancy as well. They were calling me a sorts of names and cursing my mom out. Are you kidding me? Oh wow, wow. So what are we going to do? Life is over. Oh God, please help us. Okay, look, Fatima, comport yourself. We're in school. Please stop crying. I don't feel good. I'm too young. Okay. I've had too much for this day. Okay, I'll come and check on you later on today, okay? Okay, later. Love, you are my light. You're the lamp upon my feet. All the time, my Lord, I need you. Where did I go wrong? Where did I go wrong? Hmm. Who do I who do I reach out to? Where do I go for counseling? To the pastor? Hmm. Not after the things I said about his wife. Oh. That uh, elder Isele, ah, oh, she's a bad influence. She's a really, really bad influence. Hey, Father God, my Lord, my God, have mercy on me. Have mercy on me. I have missed it. I have so missed it. Focusing on my title, I will not get anybody anywhere. Father, wherever, wherever, any way, anyhow, that I have gone wrong, forgive me. I've just been too busy running my life without paying attention to my family, to my daughter. 
this punishment is more than I can bear. Lord have mercy on me. In Jesus name. Dismissal? Are you dead, Fatima? Am I not talking to you? Come out here! Mama, I lost school because I was really having a bad day, okay? What happened? Your face is all swollen. Have you been crying? What happened now? I saw him at school today. He was cursing me out. My life is a big mess and it's all your fault. You never had time for me and you're never there for me. Are you trying to blame me for the state you are in? Yes, I'm trying to blame you. It's all your fault. You're never there for me. You never talk to me. You never, you never get to tell me what I am. You are not I will ask you. Who are you talking to? Your friend Amanda. Is she not your mate? Is she pregnant today? Okay, she's not pregnant because her mom spends time with her and her mom talks to her. You know what? I don't blame you. Amanda, Amanda, Amanda. Amanda's mother must be either jobless or her father makes a lot of money for the woman to sit down in the house and spend the whole 24 hours of the day with her. You know what? I'm going to my room! Leave me alone! Yes! Go to your room and stay there! You useless girl! Rubbish! What kind of silly nonsense is this? This little child is trying to blame me for her pregnancy! Was I pregnant at 15? Was I pregnant at 15? Go out of there and tell me that rubbish again! We don't need the mother here! Lord, my life is such a mess. Will I ever get out of this? There's so much going on at one time. Lord, if you are real, please help me. Please help me. Lord, lead me by the hand and help me face the rising sun. Comfort me through all the pain that life may bring There's no other hope that I can lean upon Lead me all What is the way forward with this now? Lead me all my life Walk by me Walk by me across the lonely roads that I may face Take my arms and let your hand show me the way Show the way to You're all welcome Despite the short notice, you all made it My God will bless you Amen You all know the reason why I call this meeting I'm tired of all these fake children of God And I think it is high time we have God expose them. It is just too much. My dear sister, we cannot help God. All we can do is pray and proceed with caution. We are all God's children, and let us not forget that. We are God's children. I agree with this, Tatima. But let us just take this thing amicably, you know, and know why. Sister John called us here. Yes, yes. <laughs> Sister John. Who are you, I think? As you all know, Dignes Felicia is claiming that my own son, you all know my son, of yes, course now, yes. impregnated the daughter. She has been running a big mouth around the whole church about the issue. She's trying to spoil the good names we have built for several years. Can you imagine? Hmm. Hmm. Wait a minute. I thought you and Sister Felicia are best friends. Best of what? Friends. Costa Simio. <laughs> I'm just tolerating her. She's not in my class now. She's not in my class now. I'm just tolerating her. Class? <laughs> what class? Okay, you're taking it too far. I don't like the way you're talking about Sister Felicia. This matter on ground needs to be resolved quietly among both families. This is not our business at all. Eh, hey, Sister Tina, what side are you on? I'm on the Lord's side. This is not what God expects from us. God wants us to be at peace with all men as it lies within us. <laughs> oh, okay, Sister John. What do you intend to do? I'm prepared to deal with Felicia and her whole family. And how do you intend to do that? 
Hmm. I wonder. The devil is a liar. When in the house of God becomes a battlefield for his children, we're not supposed to be fighting each other. I still believe this matter will be settled peacefully. Uh -uh. Don't get me angry at all, Sister May. Huh? Is it because it's not your son involved in this issue? Senior. Have you forgotten what you did when Sister Joyce was owing you money? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And how much was the money? Me? A mega $300. Hmm. The whole city was shaking. It was because of your action that led the lady out of the church and in fact the city. Mm. And you are here talking. Hmm. Anyway, that was when I was still a baby in Christ. Hmm. But now I know better. I thank God for that experience. I've made peace with Sister Joyce. Okay, no problem. Let me fight my own fight first. And then reconcile later, just like you did. Let Felicia also leave the city and the church. <laughs> but Sister Jim, I don't understand you at all. So where is the fruit of the spirit? Hey, hey, Tina, the fruit is waiting for you on the tree to plug it. Are you the only one here? I don't like your input at all. I don't know why you called us here. From the look of things, it seems you don't want any godly counsel. Anyway, I only came here because I thought it's the gathering of children of God. My dear sisters, let us not get upset with each other. The devil and his cohort are the ones that plant and enjoy discord among brethren. Let's just picture him laughing at all this. Yes, yeah, so he's laughing at Felicia and all that are supporting her directly and indirectly. That's <laughs> right, that's right. It is good for that sister Felicia. <laughs> it's high time to express shame. Big time. Wow. That's not what God wants from us. How can we live like this? Sister Augusta, is Sister Felicia not your prayer partner? Mm -hmm. She will never be anybody's portion in Jesus' name. Amen. Wow, that's just too much. You can leave us now, Sister May. I thought you should say you had to go to the store to get some fish. Please be fast about it. Are you walking me out of this meeting? She's only asking you to go mm -hmm. and buy fish, so please hurry. That is not nice. Thanks for coming. She's only telling her to go and buy fish. She has nothing better to contribute here anyway. Sister Augusta, you are not helping matters at all. You are just acting like a firecracker in this whole thing. Sister Tina, the door is wide open though. You two can go buy some fish. <laughs> hey, look here Sister Tina. Okay? Do not even provoke me. Okay? How am I not helping matters here? Please do not change the tone of this battle, no, it is not my fight, oh! oh. oh See now, what will you do if you are in my shoes? What will Jesus do? What will Jesus do? I don't know. Please tell me, since you know. <laughs> is she not talking to you? Eh? You think you are the only only one here? The one that God says, the one that God says that. Nonsense! What will Jesus do? I don't know. What will Jesus do? I don't know. Please tell me since you know. Sister John, please try and settle this matter with Sister Felicia. And try as much as you can not to involve third party. Okay, okay, wait a minute. Look, this woman. Hmm. Okay, Sister John, it's all your fault. Hmm. Hmm. Simeo, having this meeting with these fake children of God was a bad mistake. Right now, Sister Tina, you are the third party. Thanks for coming. She said thanks for coming. You too. Go and buy fish. <laughs> okay. Well, hmm. what can I say? I have spoken as God's special oracle. And I'm not part of this scheme that you guys are cooking up here. Oh my God. <laughs> Did you not know just say God oracle? Oracle. My God, you have suffered. <laughs> hey, what kind of meeting did I organize? Hmm. Ha, Tina. Hey, this one is just too fine. I wonder what he sees in this ugly duckling he calls his wife. God, how can you pay such a fine, rich man with such a scarecrow? He really had a weird sense of humor. This lady must have used diabolic powers to charm this man. It's just not possible for a correct man like this to settle for this ugly duckling. God, you really know how to order the steps of the righteous. So this time around, John, you are all mine forever. Oh, Sister Augusta, how's work? Work? Yeah. Hmm. 
I got laid off about a year ago, and since oh. then, oh, I'm yet to get a job. Sorry about that. Thank you. I never knew. Really? Your wife is aware of it. I'm surprised she never mentioned it to you. Okay, you know what? Um, just send your resume to my uh, email address. Really? Yes. Can I have your email address? Um. Uh, okay. Let me just give you my uh, my card. Oh, great, 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 great. Thank you so much. Thank okay. you so much. Yeah, go ahead and send it to me and uh, we'll see what God can do. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I do appreciate this. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. God bless you. Real what are, what are brethren for? Yeah, thank you so okay, much. Okay, you're back. Thanks, yes. Oh, okay. Okay, I'll go, sir. Thank now. you. Okay. All right. See I'm you. No problem. Take care. Bye. What's wrong with you? I'm having a really bad stomach ache. Uh uh, what did you eat? It was that soup that you cooked last night. That's the last thing I ate. Meaning, eh, do not blame it on my delicious soup. Because we both ate out of it, and obviously I'm fine. It has to be something else. What did you drink after the soup? I mean, I didn't drink anything else. I don't think that even matters. Just leave me alone, I'm in a lot of pain. Please, please, Abek, Abek, take it easy. It's just stomach pain. Probably even just too much gas. Stop whining, man. You know, I have to go now. I don't want people to see us together and start running their big mouths. Foolish people. So that's what you're concerned about right now? Lizzie, please, just go and give me some medicine, please. I guess you'll be fine. Wow. Lizzie. Are you okay? I'm just having a stomach ache, that's all. Oh Lord. Um, let me run. Let me go and get help, okay? okay. Um, who do I call? Ann! Ann! Come, 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 Ann! Hurry, 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 hurry! What's Ade going is on? What's going on? Ade, it's Ade. Where it's is a he? serious pain. It's somewhere around the corner over there. Okay. It's groaning. It, I don't know. Yes. Serious pain, isn't pain? Okay, 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 hold on. Okay. Adin, are you okay? What's wrong? I'm just having a really bad stomach ache. Okay, is it. Did you eat something, drink something? What's going on? I guess, I'm not really sure. My stomach is really bothering me. Okay, mm. okay, alright. Just stay here, hang on tight. I'm gonna go to the pharmacy and get you something, okay? Alright, yeah, thank hold you on. so much. You're a lifesaver. Me by the hand and help me face the rising sun. Comfort me through all the pain that life may bring. There's no other Oh my god, that day. I've been looking for you all over church. How do you feel? Well, I'm starting to feel a lot better now. Thank you so much. You're such a lifesaver. Okay, well, I guess it was just gas. Yeah, I guess so. Okay, do you have anyone to take you home? I can go look for somebody. You know what? That would be a good idea because I don't think I can drive home. Okay, thank all you right. so much. Stay here. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Right, okay. Thank you. You're welcome. <sighs> okay, Ade. I couldn't find anybody to take you home, so I'm going to take you home. The only option though is you have to find somebody that's gonna bring you back to pick up your car. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Thank you so much. All right, I appreciate come on, let's go. How do you feel? You're okay? Uh, I'm a little bit better. Okay. Yeah, so I'll take you home. Like a madam. Where is Lizzie? What are you looking for her? I saw Anne and Hadi walking hand in hand like two love beds. Where did you see them? Hmm. Anyway, I saw them in Hans car and I'm sure Anne is taking her way home. <laughs> Rachel, mm -hmm. would you always like to add yourself to the question? Mm. Is it body? Hey, hey, huh? What's your problem? Okay, what do you want me to do now? Eh? The Bible says a tail bearer 
separate good friend. Mm -hmm. You know when I called you traitor? Mm -hmm. I'm really sorry. I really meant to say. Hey, hey, say I pity you. Pity yourself. Hey, 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 look, hey, 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 Talking to you, there's fire on the mountain, and we need to run. Can you believe that Adi and Anne they're on their way to Adi's house? Eh, 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 how? Is it what you? Who else? There's no Rachel, the top parrot. Are you for real? This is not time for jokes, though. Jokes? Who is joking? So, by the time you wake up from your slumber, let me know. Hey, 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 what do I do? What do I do now? It's just, I'm going there right now. Okay, okay, okay. Do you want me to come with you? Are you not still in church? I'm still in church. We'll just drive by and pick me up from church and we'll go together from there. Okay, I'm, I'm on my way. I'm all right. On my way. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, I'll see you in a minute. Just like a dream happened for real. Lord, give me sight to see tomorrow. Don't let me see. Let me stray. Don't let me Don't stray. let my good heart cause me sorrows. Ah, 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 ah. Yeah, yeah, girl, Parker. I think she's the owner of the house. Anyway, <laughs> so what's the plan? Let's go over it again. Efe, how many times? This is not time to be slow. Let's go, let's go, yeah, let's so, go. So, man. so, yeah, let's go. Let's go give them fire.
Oh, Lord, I want you to help me. Oh, Lord, I want you to help me.